I've just installed Windows 10 on a laptop that came with Windows 8 and it said it was compatible so I went ahead and installed and it looks pretty good everything seems to be working uh, but I want to double check and make sure there just aren't any uh, underlying issues that I'm not quite sure about one way to do that is to uh, open device manager you can type device manager in here we've talked about that in previous videos or you can right click the little start button down here and click device manager directly if you're an IT guy this is probably the way you're going to want to do it so uh, let's do it this way looks a little more impressive I'm going to maximize this and I do have a couple of issues here you can see I've got a problem with this Bluetooth uh, it's probably a driver issue just to, for kicks let's just double click this go to driver well it says general here it says Windows has stopped this device because it has reported problems well Sometimes that happens because the, the driver needs to be updated. So I'm going to go ahead and click Update Driver. I'm going to search automatically. I'm going to see if there's something available for me to get this little yellow icon out of the way and get my little Bluetooth thing working again. Let's see what it does, see what it says. Searching online. Oh, it's downloading driver software. It's installing. I fully expect now this Bluetooth to work for me. And I expect that little yellow triangle to go away. And sure enough, it did. So I'll click close. I've got one other issue here. Let's see if we can fix that one up as well. This is a bus controller. It says the drivers are not installed. There are no compatible drivers for this device. But let's go ahead and look anyway. It never hurts to double check. I'll click update driver. Again, I don't have the driver. If I had the driver, I would put the disk in or find the download file or whatever. However, I came across that driver and I'd click this. But I don't. So I'm going to click search automatically. Again, same thing we did last time. Let's see if it can find a driver. Still searching. It's looking at Microsoft's database. You know, they update that all the time. And it's not looking very good for me on this device. But we'll give it another few minutes, see what it says. If we could get this one sorted out, our... Uh, device manager interface will be all nice and clean no little yellow triangles everything would be working fine I'm not seeing anything in reality what I would do is let this search and search and search until it came up and told me it couldn't find anything but for the purposes of this video I'm gonna go ahead and click cancel you would oh here we go it says it's unable to install looks like it might have uh, Windows could not find driver software so that's fine you know what we can come back to that another time Computer is working well though, so I'll just close this out. We'll let it refresh. Notice I do have my Bluetooth working now though, so that's a that's a great thing. I'll close this out and say goodbye.